Holy cow, it's early. I gotta go to the store. So last night we were messing around with this thing and uh, whatever the hell that is, but it's leaking a lot of gas. So I need to go find parts. I have not woken up this early in a long time, but uh, I need to go make sure I can find that part so I can start my golf cart later, but it was leaking like crazy yesterday. So uh, wish me luck. Like we talked about last night, my neighbor has a uh, uh, handicap license plate and a disability uh, sticker or whatever. So um, hopefully that'll get us around. Hopefully I can find a part. So where do you buy breakfast? Everybody's closed. Oh, there you go, funnel cakes for breakfast. And this guy's jogging? What the hell? Maybe that's why he's in shape. Tequila bar's closed. So that said Porsche. And yesterday down here I saw a bunch of Corvettes somewhere. So I guess Porsches and Corvettes have their own parking. Yep, there's Porsche. Apparently I gotta show my ticket on the way out. <laughs> what gets me back in? <laughs> this one now. Thank you, sir. See you later. Like I said, I have not woken up so early in a long time. Well, I guess I don't need the wipers. So I asked him what I need to get back in, and uh, that's a funny name, huh? Let's hope that doesn't happen this weekend. I haven't seen the sunrise in forever. It said 7.30 in the morning, they're open. So on this website, k and Golf Cart said this address is open at 7.30, but Golf Cart Doctors online is open at nine o'clock. So I still have an hour. And the Red Solo Cup Bar is closed. There's a whole crap load of parts over there. Hmm. Starting route to 2530 US Highway 27 North. Head north on US Highway 27 North. That's another place around here. It's four miles away, so I'm not even gonna bother calling them because whatever. I could burn some time, and that's the place that uh, that is closed. Why did I wake up so early? Oh, what time's like AutoZone or whatever open? I saw a couple uh, places on the way here. I wonder if they have it, but I don't even know what the hell that part is called. Uh, I just passed AutoZone. There's Advanced Auto Parts. So, okay, this place is... Uh, about a mile away, I gotta make a U-turn anyway, so uh, we'll go to that place first, and then we'll stop by the car parts places. Now there's an RV. The destination is on your right, 2530 US Highway 27 North. That's not it, and that's not it. Okay, I guess, Arrived. yeah, no, I didn't. Let's see if they have golf cart stuff. He said, turn around and go across the street from Home Depot. And uh, 
they should have the parts over there. The destination is on your right, 23 up 3 US Highway 27 North. Okay, so he said this place is on the left. Oh, there it is, golf carts. Okay. Yay. Arrived at the Home Depot. Apparently everything's open in town except for uh, the golf cart places because that place is open at 9 o'clock also. And I already ate breakfast so kind of don't want to eat again. Might as well get some fuel. And a coffee. Uh oh. What was that? And now? to uh, take a nap in their parking lot here. I got 45 minutes. But apparently somebody tagged me in three photos. Oh, that's when I fell. That's awesome. Yep, that's me. Yep. There you go. That's awesome. Yep, I fell. Great shot. Who took that? There you go. Thanks for the shot. Awesome. I should have turned around. Yay, it looks like they're open 15 minutes early. All right, well, they were very nice people there, but um, unfortunately, $183, I had to get a whole new carburetor. And he said it's easy to fix, so or easy to put on, so we'll see what happens. I'm gonna stop in AutoZone real quick because I think he said I need a 10 millimeter wrench or whatever, so uh, I wanna make sure I have it. I don't feel like driving back here anyway. And another $63 spent. I just want to make sure I have stuff to fix it because I don't feel like driving out later again in traffic. So I ran back in and got one more thing because of my squeaky belt. Look, eliminates squeaks. And I'm back. Apparently there's some sort of a truck in there. I need to go look at that later on. Listen to them racing around the track. Okay, this is my first time. You guys know I don't know shit about this stuff, but this is supposed to go there, and he said it's easy. So let me start taking it apart. Yep, he told me it's 10 millimeter, it's 10 millimeter. Oh, that was easy. But wait a minute. Oh, okay. That'll just go onto here. Hey, if I get this done by myself, I'll be damn proud. No, that's no big deal. That's just this thing, and uh, I guess whatever was strapped to up there broke. Okay, but what about this now? Oh, I said it was easy. I'm this. I'll take this on. I just... Ah, there you go. Damn, I'm good. Okay, but...
that should work. Damn, I'm proud of myself so far. Let's see if it works. Oh yeah. Okay, what is this for? What the hell is this for? I got two of them here now. Ugh. This goes here. Beats the hell out of me. Well, I'm putting them both here. One, two, I don't know. Double protection. That's it. I don't want to break anything. But shit, what the hell is this? Oh, wait. Oh, okay, that piece. Whew, scaring me. Scaring me. guys will be so proud of me. Look at this. Dr. Sot. Hey, 47 years old. This is the first time I've ever done anything like this. With one minor break, but that should be no problem. Look at that air filter. Ugh. So now, I gotta figure out where this, oh, what the hell is this? Look at this, that was inside here. So I guess they had two, one there and another one. Oh, the hardest part of the whole thing is putting this hose back on here.
guess that didn't work. Do I really need this piece? Well, you know what, better yet, how about if I put that on the outside if I can? Do I really need that? Let me see, I'm gonna go without it. Got to zip tie that up there or something. I don't know, he had it screwed on, I guess, or something, because something snapped. Yeah, this is better without it. I don't know what the hell that was there for. Oh, yeah. Got to zip tie this up there or something. Good spot for it. There you go. Now some belt loop. Let's see how this works. So we just got back from the office and Uncle Ed pulls through. Look at that. Poor guy's got to suffer in pain, but uh, we'll get to wheel him around on a golf cart. Uh, that's what you see at the races. <laughs> <laughs> 